Good morning, St. Francis. I'm Jacob Smolinski. And I'm Carrick Weishner. Today is Thursday, December 15th, letter F day. Please turn off and put away your cell phones and rise for the morning prayer and pledge. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Lord, make me an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, pardon. Where there is doubt, faith. Where there is despair, hope. Where there is darkness, light. And where there is sadness, joy. O Divine Master, grant that I may not so much seek to be consoled as to console, to be understood as to understand, to be loved as to love. For it is in giving that we receive, it is in pardoning that we are pardoned, and it is in dying that we are born to eternal life. Amen. St. Francis, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is your last chance to buy a yearbook. Don't miss this opportunity to buy something that will last you a lifetime and remind you of your wonderful memories here at St. Francis. This year's yearbook, deemed Traditions and Transitions, can be purchased in the campus store for $85 by cash or check before or after school. Don't miss out! Hey, Carrick! Is there uh, someone special in your life? Oh, well, uh, there might be. Why do you ask? Well, if you want to make a good impression or start wooing that girl of your dreams with a simple statement of your affection, Student Council will be selling Christmas candy canes with holiday messages to be sent to neighboring schools for $1. <laughs> good job, St. Francis. Way to lose your lunch cards. Temporary lunch cards are no longer going to be accepted at lunch due to the drastic amount of students losing their permanent lunch cards. Replacements can be purchased in the main office for a $5 charge. Be more responsible. Juniors and seniors, your final 10 service hours are due in January. It's coming up fast, and you sure don't want to spend your days after school in detention, so take it upon yourself to get out there and get your hours completed. If you are looking for ways to get those hours, on December 27th, you can help pack a truck full of supplies for the Nicaraguan Mission Project. See Mr. Reichenberg for details. But what if I don't have any ideas for service hours? Well, Jake, Mr. Reichenberg always has ideas, so if you have a lack of ideas, speak to him before or after school. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Na Spanish Club is having its annual Christmas party this Monday, the 19th. If you are interested, sign up outside of room 3. Feliz Navidad. Hey, Carrick, what, what is your uh, favorite TV show? Uh, numbers, of course. Do you enjoy solving algebraic functions on your free time? You know it. Well, I think Math Club would be pretty good fit for you. It's open for everyone, and if you're interested, it is meeting after school today at 2.15 in room 2F. I think I'll give it a try. Yeah. Parlez-vous français? What does that mean? <laughs> I have no idea, but French Club is dining at Daniel's Restaurant in Hamburg on this Tuesday, December 20th. Permission slips must be turned in today if you are interested. I'm sure the meal will be delicioso. Jake, that's Spanish. I'm sure the meal will be wunderbar. Jake, that's German. I'm sure the meal will be optimist. That's not even French. What are you even trying to say? F. Y. M. Wow, that's starting to get old. Well, FYM is holding its largest trip of the year to Nicaragua, uh, Niagara Falls and the Fatima Shrine. Come see all the beautiful lights and have a great time. If you want to go, talk to Mr. Reichenberg in room 2A. That's all the announcements for the day. I'm Jacob Smolinski. And I'm Carrick Weishner. Stay tuned for the student shout out and our new segment, Seriously, with Mark Schmiel and Luke Healy. Look at this guy. Look at how much fun he's having. That's because he bought a St. Francis yearbook. Now look at this guy. He's not having any fun. He didn't buy a yearbook. If you don't buy a yearbook, you may become frustrated with yourself and become angry. Or you may start to see things that aren't really there and run in panic. If you do this, you may even curl yourself up in a little ball and just wait. Oh no. You may begin to argue with yourself and yell at inanimate objects. Or even do things, oh no, no, not the window. You may go insane. What do you do do? <laughs> oh my god.
season is once again upon us, and I know many of you have already sent your letters to Santa, but I want to know, what was the number one item on your Christmas list? Bongo drums. Bongo. Oprah. Yes. Kindle. Sabres tickets. Sabres tickets. Sabres tickets. Oprah. Yes. New iPod. Cameras. A friend. Christmas shoes. Probably some bicep bands, some headbands, and a uh, couple of victories. Life. Uh, I don't know. Upgrades for my computer. Oprah. Nike gift card. Green shoes. Monty Python and the Holy Grail on Blu ray. Socks. What kind of socks? <laughs> Mid caps. Oh, I love this. I want a new sweater for Christmas. World peace. New Santa hat. Oprah. I don't want anything for Christmas. I want to make my brothers the best Christmas ever. Tires. Show 12. A new copy of Wonder. The new Justin Bieber CD. Teddy bear? A car. A uh, snowboard. I don't have anything. Uh, a hockey stick. For a massage chair. Minutes no, for my track phone. Oprah. That's all for this week's student shout out. I'm Scott Dosser. Merry Christmas. Good morning, St. Francis. It's almost Christmas. I believe you are excited about that. So, the Chinese word of the week is 圣诞快乐, which means Merry Christmas. Say it again, 圣诞快乐. Alright guys, have a great Christmas everyone. See you next year. Hello St. Francis, I'm Luke Healy, and I'm Mark Shamili, and this is a segment we call Seriously. Seriously, why is it that gas prices mysteriously go up when Christmas comes around? Seriously, is anyone else sick of stereotypical Christmas commercials with little kids running down the stairs and opening presents? Seriously, Walmart, just because it's Halloween doesn't mean you could put up Christmas decorations. Seriously, 102.5, we're sick of the Christmas songs already. I never want to hear the song Silver Bells again. Seriously, the house on the corner? Your over-the-top Christmas lights are keeping me up at night. Are they necessary? Seriously, Santa Claus, where's Jesus? Seriously, Grandma, do I really need another pair of socks? Seriously, teachers, giving us homework over Christmas break? Thanks, Merry Christmas to you, too. Seriously, Christmas, how many don't eat the yellow snow jokes can you make? Seriously, lady with the pepper spray, was it worth the $30 off? Seriously, 12 days of Christmas? I heard Christmas music the moment we cut the turkey. Seriously, Buffalo, we know it's cold. You don't need to complain about it. And that's this week's segment of Seriously. Seriously. Remember, St. Francis, stay smart. This has been a WSTF-TV production.